Good evening, good evening, good evening. Greetings and welcome to Queen Bee's Half Hour of Jewelry Shopping Power. This is a beautiful, beautiful Friday, December 29th. December 30th, December 29th, 2023. The last Friday of 2023. And we commemorate and observe International Cello Day, Still Need to Do Day, No Interruptions Day, and this is Tick Tock Day, not to be confused with the Tip Top app. Tick Top app. Oh my goodness. Okay. So for the month of December, we have commemorated and celebrated Art and Architecture Month. Bingo Month, Eggnog Month, Gift of Sight Month, Learn a Foreign Language Month, Made in America Month, Month of Giving, National Cat Lovers Month, National Human Rights Month, National Pair Month, Operation Santa Paws, Read a New Book Month, Christmas, Save Toys and Gift Month, Universal Human Rights Month, Worldwide Food Service Safety Month, and Write a Friend Month. Now, December 26th through January 1st, we commemorate Kwanzaa from the Swahili phrase, which means Matunda Ya Kwanzaa, or First Fruits, which refer to the agricultural harvest festivals that are found throughout Africa this time of year, according to Kelly Naves, who is a specialist of oral histories for the National Museum of African American History and Culture. So welcome, welcome, welcome. Come on in here. Come on in here. I have the January Fashion Fix sets for you for the month. So we're going to go ahead on and jump right in and get started. The very first one that I want to share with you this evening is going to be set number 181. And this one is called Sunset Sightings. We have two necklaces in this bunch. This is called Carnival Confidence from the Sunset Sightings collection. I will take her off the easel so that you can see we have this array of colorful beads in a range of textures, opacities, and finishes that are threaded along an invisible wire as a tiny silver bead infused the design with sporadic metallic accents. It is a short necklace. It has a two inch extender, so you have room to leverage it for length. And we have these beautiful orange, pink, and classy uh, beads that form these beautiful earrings that are interfaced and connected to standard fish hook fittings for pierced ears. Now, each one of these fashion fix sets comes with a total of five pieces. So that was two because that is one necklace with a pair of earrings. This particular Fashion Fix set has six pieces because it has two necklaces. This sec second necklace is called Concession Couture. So we have these rich, colorful gems that cut into geometric shapes here. And they have these beautiful, sharp, faceted surfaces that swing from a dainty paperclip chain. This is what we call a paperclip chain. Isn't that fascinating? This is double layered. So we have the thin silver chain. Then we have the uh, gem clip chain that give it more depth and intensity. Hey, Jamal, thank you for joining me this evening. How are you? Always a pleasure to see you. Now, this particular necklace is called Concession Couture. We have these faceted surfaces and these beautiful gemstones that swing from this uh, gem clip, paper clip chain in silver, and it has 
a second serpentine chain to give it more flavor and pizzazz. It too has an adjustable clasp closure with a two inch extender so you have room to leverage it. And then it comes with this beautiful pair of uh, yellow earrings that are in a beautiful gemstone that interface and connect to standard fish hook fitting for pierced ears. Happy holidays to you as well. And so we have two necklaces in this set. So with those earrings, that is four pieces. Then we have the fascinating go get it earrings, the extra pair that are more fierce. These are called Flashy Festival. So we have these colorful beads and silver accents that are threaded along a silver wire in a capricious pattern, curling into an airy, oversized hoop that is two and a quarter inches in diameter. This is a very thin, uh, lightweight silver wire that interfaces and connects to standard fishhook fittings for pierced ears. And as you can see, this also sets off these two necklaces infamously. This is the Sunset Sightings collection. So, so far, I've shown you five pieces. And the sixth piece is this beautiful, versatile bracelet that features the light blue cording and it's called Fairground Fun. As you can see, we have a yellow gemstone threaded through these illicit light blue cords. And then we have a conglomerate of the Carnival Confidence, as you saw in the necklace, and also saw these beadings in the earrings and the hoops that I just showed you. And this is a drawstring. So what you do with this is you pull the strings to open up the bracelet. You put your wrist through, and then when you get it through, you pull it back. And so on your wrist, it's gonna look like that, okay? And that's all of set 181, okay? Very nice, very flashy and classy. Let me give you another overview of set number 181. We have five pairs, uh, three pairs of earrings here because earrings come with this necklace, these little ones here. Then we have earrings with this necklace, which accessorizes the gemstones in the second chain on here. And then last but not least, to complete this set, we have this drawstring bracelet. Give me just a second. That accessorizes and really brings all of the colors together. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six pieces. 2160, ladies and gentlemen. It doesn't get any better. And that is your Sunset Sightings uh, Paparazzi Collection for the month of January. 2160, okay? Up next, we have the Simply Santa Fe. And uh, if you don't know, let me just tell you Simply Santa Fe is something that you find in the Southwest, New Mexico, Oklahoma, um, Texas, in that area. These are tonight's set features a uh, celebrate the natural world with crystals and earthy charms. And this is a beautiful handcrafted Simply Santa Fe trend blend. We have these wire wrapped stones and their free-spirited designs, which evoke a wanderlust spirit where every day is an adventure. So as you know, natural crystals and earth-inspired elements are set against a golden backdrop in the necklace. So this is what set number 182 looks like as far as this beautiful geode glam uh, necklace is, 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 is concerned. As you can see, we have this eclectic collection of natural crystals and gold charms that uh, dance along a gold paper clip chain and with a vibrant pink geo taken center stage. 
and that is authentic. Isn't that beautiful? We have some charms on the necklace that brings out the vibe and the sensitivity of it. It comes with a beautiful pair of paperclip chain link earrings that are interfaced and connected to standard fishhook fittings for pierced ears. Her name is Jode Glam, and this is from the Simply Santa Fe collection. That necklace is item number 182. Now, we have a fascinating pair of earrings that may be a little bit mixed match in um, density. Here we call these beauties the Excavated Elegance. It is a dainty gold hoop that is filled with a barbelled end cap, and it anchors the chiseled white crystal that is affixed to it with a delicate gold wire, as you can see. These are post. This is set number 182 from the Simply Santa Fe collection. We have this fascinatingly beautiful bracelet that is called Mineral Merit. It is an adjustable class closure bracelet that has a two inch extender so that you can leverage it for length. I wouldn't go past a size 8 wrist with this. This is called Mineral Merit. And we have that raw cut white crystal wrapped in gold wire and attached to a gold paper clip chain that wraps around the wrist in artisanal perfection. Isn't that beautiful? And to complete this set... We have a very fascinating um, ring that is called Mineral Masterpiece. So we have that stunning peak geode encased in gold foiling and set atop a pair of arcing gold bands. This is so raw and authentic and the shape is very ostentatious i slip it on my finger so that you can get an up close and personal view as you can see it features a stretchable band for a flexible fit so for the simply santa fe collection set number 182 we have the geode glam necklace we have the mineral merit bracelet we have these fascinating excavated elegance earrings that are in addition to the ones that come with the necklace. And we complete the set with this scintillating mineral masterpiece ring that has the same centerpiece in pink as this beautiful necklace. This complete set number 182 Simply Santa Fe. And as I stated earlier, this is indicative of what you see in the Midwest of the states. Oklahoma, New Mexico, Texas, in that region. Okay, so then we come over here and we want to get dressy because we want to get fierce and fiercely classy. So I've got something here for you. What you would see on the streets of New York City, that fiercely Fifth Avenue that features those pearls and rhinestones. So this is the necklace for set number 183, which is from fiercely Fifth Avenue. We have a timeless palette of pearls and rhinestones in a uh, Victoria's Victorian S revival in this fiercely Fifth Avenue trend blend which is vintage. We have these beautiful rosettes that are featured here. And then we have subtle accents of soft pink that serves effortless femininity with high-end fashion. This particular necklace is called Sophisticated Style. She comes with a beautiful pair of badging, uh, white small rhinestone earrings that are interfaced and connected to standard fishhook fittings for pierced ears. Her name is Sophisticated Style. She is the first piece in the Fiercely Fifth Avenue collection set for the month of 
January. And let me tell you, this girl is bad to the core. Not the bone, the core, okay? All right. So then we come on over here. We have a fascinating additional pair of earrings that are called Suave Sensation. These earrings consist of tiny white pearls around the edges of tender peach petals. And they wrap around a classic pearl in the center. Aren't those fascinating? Very fashionable, don't you think? Cute. Okay. And then we have this fascinating bracelet. And this girl is another one that is bad to the core. She features a two-inch extender. I wouldn't go past a size eight wrist, but look at this beauty. She wraps around your wrist with an adjustable clasp closure. Her name is Cultivated Charm. She features these vintage brooch-like charms that link around the wrist, showcasing a range of texture and sheen. Isn't she lovely? This is the Fierce and Fifth Avenue collection. And to complete this ferocious set, we have this beautiful, beautiful Debonair Delight Ring. We have these tender peach petals that are coated in a hint of pearlescent sheen that are bordered by these beautiful tiny white pearls as they encircle a pearl drop center. So, for the Fiercely Fifth Avenue collection, set number 183, we feature the sophisticated style necklace. Then we have this fierce pair of earrings that are post, that are absolutely fabulous. Then we, for our wrist candy, we have this beautiful, beautiful cultivated charm bracelet. And to complete your finger, we have this debonair delight. So here we have five pieces, necklace, earrings, bracelet, additional earrings and ring to uh, complete the Fiercely Fifth Avenue set for the month of January. And this is set number 183. 183, okay. So, if that wasn't fierce enough for you, hold on. I got three down and two to go. All right. So, then we come over here to the glimpses of Malibu. And when we show glimpses of Malibu, we're showing you what we're seeing on the streets of Malibu, California. This is making a fashion statement. We have a lot of kaleidoscopic exaggerated shapes and vibrant colors in this lively glimpses of Malibu trend blend, which is unseasonably bright in color palette that add a cheerful ambiance and a capricious butterfly accent to this beautiful whimsical set. So we're gonna go ahead on and introduce to some and present to others the Glimpses of Malibu. This is set number 184. And we start with this Bright Club two-tiered necklace where we have a vibrant collection of colorful faceted teardrops that mingle with these dainty silver butterflies to create a whimsical display. These are small silver butterflies that are infiltrated in these two layers interfaced and connected to a silver chain, which features an adjustable clasp closure. It has a two inch extender, so you have room to leverage it for length. It comes with a beautiful pellet pair of earrings that are in that beautiful, beautiful peak hue that is the same as that gemstone color right there. So this is a necklace for set number 184. Her name is Bright Club. Now, as you all know, paparazzi usually, 99.9% .9 of the time, come back with a bodacious, bringing pair of earrings, and they're no different. We have these beauties right here that are called Bright This Way. We have that dainty silver butterfly that flutters atop a faceted 
pink teardrop, which swings from an inverted yellow teardrop above it. So when we are putting these Pantone colors together, we uh, want you to think about the orange tiger, the pink peacock, and the um, brown sugar. Isn't that beautiful? This is set number 184. These are the beautiful additional earrings, and they are called Bright This Way. Now, for your wrist candy, we have this stretchable um, bracelet. It's called In All the Bright Places because we stick to this beautiful palette of color. And we have these faceted round and teardrop shaped beads that wrap around the wrist in chromatic succession with each colorful accent separated by a stack of classic silver beads. See there? Isn't that beautiful? And you just slip it over your wrist like that and there's that fascinating bracelet. Now to complete this Glimpses of Malibu set, we have this fascinating in plain bright ring. It is an oversized teardrop that is set in a silver frame. It features a silver butterfly that sits atop a beautiful pink teardrop that creates a colorful backdrop upon which a silver butterfly rests. Isn't that beautiful? So for Glimpses of Malibu, set to number 184, we have the Bright Club bracelet. We have these beautiful post earrings that are called Bright This Way. Bright This Way. Then we have our wrist candy in all the bright places. And then in plain bright, we have this beautiful, beautiful ring. So that takes care of the Glimpses of Malibu collection for the month of January. Okay? Each set is $21.60 plus shipping. Tonight, I only have one of each. So if I need more than one, I will go ahead on and place that order. So if you see something you like, go ahead on and comment with the set number. And I will do my best to get it for you. Last but not least, our fifth set this evening is the Magnificent Musings Collection. Magnificent Musings are what you see on the streets of Chicago, Illinois. This is making a fashion statement. We have a collision of industrial grit and soft grunge that unlocks unexpected charm in this Magnificent Musings trend blend. It is bold, it is dramatic, this set uses metallic hardware to walk a fine line between cherished sentiment and fierce femininity. And having said that, let me introduce you to Against the Lock, okay? So we have a conglomerate of, of chains. Then we have a silver lock in the center, and it is flanked by these silver keys, it is threaded along an oversized silver chain, features an adjustable class closure. We have that much of an extender and it kind of fits close to your neck, but not exactly a hugger unless you have a, a uh, fatter neck and then you would need to use perhaps an extender and the chains just drape accordingly. Now for the earrings, we have two pairs of earrings here. We have these small uh, silver hoops that are interfaced to these beautiful keys. And it's called the key to everything. We have one for each ear. And they are congruent and consistent with the post. Then we have the unlock perfection, which accessorizes that. And these you just press over your earlobe. They're making a beauty statement. We have three silver bars that stack into a dynamic soft cuff that anchors the strands of these beautiful silky silver chains. 
and they fall in dramatic cascades, okay? So you just press those on this part of your ear, and voila. For your wrist, we have this fascinating bracelet that is called Watch the Lock. So here we have an oversized silver chain that is featuring an adjustable clasp closure. We have a two-inch extender. We have a charm lock. And we have chains threaded throughout the oversized chain to give it depth, intensity, and strength. So this is set number 185. And this is the Magnificent Musings Collection for the month of January. We have that beautiful, beautiful Against the Lock necklace. We have the beautiful Watch the Lock bracelet. We have this fascinating pair of post earrings that feature these keys. Let me turn it around the other way. Ah, bear with me. I'm going to get it together here. 185. And then last but not least, we have the cuffs that clip over your ear as well. So, we have one, two, three, four, five. Okay? Set number 185, Magnificent New Things. All right, all right, all right. So, I want to say, first of all, thank you, thank you, thank you for joining me this evening. It is always a pleasure to see you. Hey, Wanisha, happy Friday. Glad to see you. Thank you for joining me this evening. I got off to a late start, but nonetheless, I'm here. So my prayer remains one and the same. Until we meet again, I ask Father God to hold each one of us in the palm of his hand. If you see something you like, please feel free to reach out. Thank you, thank you, thank you for a fabulous 2023. We had some valleys and peaks and mountains here, but we are doing well. We made it through. So I want to say thank you to everyone that support Queen Bee Jewels. I appreciate you. I'm looking forward to a happy, fulfilling 2024, and I wish that for you as well. So my prayer remains one and the same until we meet again. I ask Father God to hold each one of us in the palm of his hand. Thank you for joining me this evening. Have a good night and be blessed. Good night.